One of the other features available with Chimpified is the ability to easily create email campaigns that promote your products in your store and in general. Um, this is available for, for 30 days free from anybody who installs it. Um, and otherwise, the Compose email, uh, Compose campaigns feature is only available to the Plus plan. However, if uh, we go back into our Shopify store here on the, on the back side, and let's say I take my products, and what I'm looking to do here is, I guess, promote this product here, customer-focused exuding function. <laughs> this is a test shop, so these are all just sort of grabbed and, and random. But as you can see, I'm at my product detail page. And Chimpified has added a link here that says email using MailChimp. And if I go ahead and click that, it's going to uh, take me over to Chimpified. Obviously, I'm logged into Chimpified right now, so it's okay. Um, you may be asked to log in, but that's no big deal. And as you can see, it's now created a campaign for me. I've got to answer a couple of quick questions. And a basic campaign, we provide a basic template. This is just a very simple, very basic template for uh, people to get started with. And really all we have to do is select our list. I'm going to send it to my customers. Um, we'll call it product promotion. You can call this whatever you want. Buy this product <laughs> is our subject line. Um, and then you notice down here, select a template. We have opted to use uh, the Chimpify basic templates. And actually that's because we don't have any custom templates built. And finally I can select which folder in uh, my MailChimp campaign I want it, or account I want it to file into. I don't have any folders created, so it will just stay unfiled. Uh, authenticate and auto tweet are automatically selected. Let me just go ahead and click MailChimp. Send me to MailChimp to finish here. Um, and it's going to say, please be patient for a minute. And the reason we do this is that uh, it can take a little while and to build a campaign. And then also, we ask you to go to MailChimp afterwards because there are certain things we just can't add through the API. Uh, Google Analytics is one of them. And also, as we talked about in the other tutorials, uh, the e-commerce 360 tracking is another one. And then, of course, we're going to want to go through um, and verify the subject matter of our, our email. Uh, we don't ever recommend sending an email without sort of taking a look at it first. So as you can see, this imported code in. We can do a quick pop-up preview here. And you can see that our product information was automatically um, put into our email. So from there, we can go ahead and uh, move on to the text section, text section of the email, and our final checklist at the very end. Uh, the text section was also automatically input. And then finally, we move on to the very uh, overview, and then you schedule and send out your email campaign. Um, there's really not a lot to it. <laughs> it seems like there should be more to explain, but but the idea is that. Uh, you know, rather than you having to spend a whole lot of time pulling information from your Shopify store to promote it, um, Chimpify provides a very easy uh, sort of link between the two.